Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Chinaza's Life. If you're new here and if you're returning, first of all, I want to say thank you for tuning in with me today. I definitely appreciate your support. In today's video, as you guys can see, by the title and also by what's behind me. We have another renovation slash addition to my room, which is going to be this type of bookshelf or bookcase that's floating that I saw on Amazon. And this has been a trend that I've been seeing going on for a while now, just having like floating shelves or floating drawers, just different things like that. And I realized that that space in the back of my room was kind of empty ever since I moved my bed around. And I was thinking like, what could I fill it with? Like, should I put a mirror there? But that's not really a good source of light. Like there's not gonna be a lot of light in that corner. And then it might interfere with opening my closet, different things like that. And then it came to me, I'm like, you know, putting a hanging shelf there would be perfect. I can also add in more plants there. You guys have already seen that my plant collection has grown, which by the way, I'm definitely going to do a whole video on that as well because I feel like you guys have only really seen like one or two of my plants and I have so many more to show you. And also guys, once I put up that dresser or drawer or bookshelf, bookcase, whatever you want to call it, I'm going to be eventually filling it up with plants. So I'll probably bring you guys along that journey to show you how it goes about where I get my plants from, plant care tips, whole bunch of different things like that. And guys, in addition, you guys know that I do have that white desk that's in my room. And you know, it's kind of been going through some things lately ever since I started to use it more and more. And especially I did my nails on there one time and the acetone like took off some of the paint and it's actually been looking pretty crazy. So I'm looking forward to also sanding that down and respray painting it and just kind of reupholstering it, I guess is the best word. So that's basically what I'll be doing in this video, bringing you guys along with me as I just, you know, renovate different things that are already existing in my room and then also adding in new pieces into my room and guys I feel like my space will finally be almost complete aside from like artwork and also guys I'll be having a special helper today my older brother Chike is going to be helping me to assemble things and to also sand down spray paint all that good stuff we're both really into like interior design real estate all those different types of things so he finds a lot of joy in these things if it's less work for me I don't mind so without further ado let's go ahead and get into today's video all right guys so as you can see obviously my lighting and everything is still set up but the first step is going to be clearing off my desk so that obviously I can move it outside so that we can begin sanding it down and eventually spray painting so we're gonna go ahead and do that and also guys this is a better look at the corner just all nice and empty just surrounded by my light for right now so I'm really excited basically the fixture is going to be in this area and I just hope that it looks really good. I haven't even opened the box yet so I'll be doing all of that on camera with you guys. And if it looks bad, I'm not gonna hold you. We're gonna have to send that back to Amazon because I cannot have something not cute in my room, you know? Guys, I'm trying to keep my lights in place so bad so I don't have to move them later around, but obviously this one's in front of the door. So therefore, I have to move it too. That was already a lot of hard work, y'all. So as you guys can see, I'm outside now. You guys have met you before. Appeared on the channel a few times. Any words to say? Uh, just love each other, love one another. <laughs> no, it's true. Points have been made. Alright guys, so before I get started, I, want, I just want to say, look at this lighting, but before I get started, I want to show you guys why I'm even painting the table, because to the normal eye, at least from here, it may not look like it needs to be painted, but trust me, y'all, it's going through it, it looks crazy. So this is what the table looks like, and as you can see, that's what I meant by like the acetone stains and stuff like that, and yeah, it just looks pretty not white, lots of stains, 
just looks dirty honestly so again the first thing that i want to do is kind of wipe the table down with some soapy water just to make sure that i'm getting off all possible dirt before we go ahead and sand it down don't leave me don't leave me all right guys the table is sanded down now wiped down we're ready to spray hopefully it goes well if not we tried but here it goes okay guys so after two ish right two layers of paint this is what it's looking like and as you can see it's a drastic improvement from what it looked like before so we're just gonna wait a few minutes before applying the next coat but it literally looks like a way different table brand new Yeah. Wow! It's magnificent! <laughs> uh -uh. Just like that. It looks brand new. Alright guys, so now that the painting is done, we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next step which again is putting up that bookcase slash shelf slash whatever we're gonna call it if it even looks good so that's the next unboxing that will be happening this table oh you guys can't see Hold on. so the table apparently needs to dry to touch within an hour but then within 24 hours it should be like dried completely so I'm just gonna leave it in the garage clear out some space hopefully no bugs or any mess gets on it but as you can see, it looks really good, like a brand new table. So really excited about that. All right guys, so I'm back in my room now and let me go ahead and show you the package. This is the bookcase slash bookshelf thingy that I ordered from Amazon. And my first time opening it, so I hope that I like it. So this is the package that came in. Very nicely packaged. Oh, wow. I think you just have to hang it up. Oh wait, they put some hooks in here. Okay guys, so this is what came in the package. Let's go ahead and do this. So I stepped away and came back and it's finished. Okay, shout out to Chike. <laughs> You think it's sturdy? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Honestly, I might as well shift some plants over there so I know what it looks like. Okay guys, so I'm gonna fill this up for now with some of my fake plants that have just been chilling on my windowsill because they had nowhere else to go. So... Okay. So for now, this is what we have. All right, guys, so I am back. I hope that you enjoyed seeing how me and my brother were able to spray paint. Mainly him, he held it down because I realized I'm like, I'm wearing all white. This is probably gonna mess up my clothes, all that stuff. So it was clutch having him around to be able to help me spray paint. So shout out to Chike once again. And guys, if you cannot tell, behind me, we have that new 
bookshelf mini thingy set up and it's literally the perfect size. Again, I got this on Amazon for around $25 I wanna say, so it's super inexpensive and as you can see, it just added like the perfect touch to my room. So again, I'm just super hype about how that came out. And to be honest, I like how it's set up right now. I don't even know if I will put a real plant there because what you do see there, like the plants that are there right now, basically didn't have a home before. They were just on my windowsill just because they didn't fit on the other desk. So I might just leave it as is, honestly. I like the way that it looks, but you guys know that I do tend to switch things up on the fly, on the random. So I'm saying this now, but watch in like two weeks, it might be a completely different story, but we're gonna see. So guys, that is all that I have for you today. Thank you so much for staying tuned up until this point. If you're not subscribed to my channel, make sure to pause this video and hit that subscribe button. And also make sure to tap that bell so you can turn on post notifications so that you do know when I am posting a new video. And guys, if you're not following me on Instagram, I actually did like a kind of mini series, or at least I tried to uh, during this whole thing as I was going along. So if you want exclusive content and to kind of see things before they make it to YouTube, definitely make sure to check out my Instagram and follow me over there at Chinaza's Life. And if you're not following me over on Twitter, make sure to follow me over there at Chinaza's Lens. Let me know down in the comments below if you like this type of video and if you'd like to see more of this type of content in the future. I'll definitely make sure to show you guys more of my kind of like room decor slash overall decor in general. I appreciate y'all and I look forward to having you on my next video. So make sure to stay tuned for that. Bye everyone.